Um, I received a call, must have been around 5.35, 5.40, um, from our Director of Residence Life, Molly Sh uh, Schumacher Burroughs. And she let me know that uh, there was a fire at the biz, and um, she said, Jim, I think it's really bad. Arrived, um, I took to I talked to Rick Steinus, the fire chief, and uh, asked about people first, and of course he was quick to tell me that uh, everyone had been reported to be out and everyone was accounted for. So after that, it's kind of a blur because that's what I wanted to know and that's what I was happy about. I really give credit to um, you know the fire department, the police department for their amazing responsiveness, uh, their deep care. It was quite a challenge because not only were we coming off a storm, but the winds were pretty high and uh, that was tough stuff. Um, also really pleased and grateful for the confluence of um, Good Samaritans and blessings. Um, best as I know, um, we had a, a staff member, a custodian in the visitation hall who smelled smoke and he was able to start knocking on doors. Uh, there was a, a radio disc jockey uh, that came running over from the radio station seeing the fire, started knocking on doors. Um, two other staff members from the radio uh, building came over and did the same. Our RAs were up and of course doing that and then I also understand according to the fire department that a neighbor had seen the lightning strike the cupola and uh, happened to call 9-11 at that time. Oh I'm quite certain that most of the items are either damaged or lost. Uh, depends on where a student lived but um, anybody who was up on that fourth floor uh, of the north building of course probably lost everything. Anybody who's on the floors below there's got to be some water and smoke damage. Again, I don't know what, how, how significant it will be. And then on the south building, um, there was certainly smoke and water seepage into there. Again, how extensive, we don't yet know. Um, students and uh, our residential staff and the firefighters are in the hall now, trying to reclaim as much as possible, um, but I'm not optimistic.